So in this new series that I'm adding to my channel, uh, my pocket review series, is basically mobile games that I'm playing in my spare time that I like and enjoy. Um, so let's just get right into it and take a look at a, a game called Redungeon. And basically I'm just going to go over very briefly, maybe two or three minutes, you know, of gameplay, what I like about it, you know, what it involves, what's your goal, etc. So starting off, this is for an iOS Android devices. Um, you can see that it's a top down and it basically is a endless dungeon crawler to where your ultimate goal is to see how far you can get without dying and of course you know the further you get into the dungeon the more challenges that they throw at you you know you'll have um sliding platforms to you know even ice on the platforms to bats to you know skeleton guards to your occasional you know gelatinous cube that will devour you so i'm sure someone's going to say well i'm just going to stand still and take my time you can't stand still uh, if you stand still for so long, you have these like evil eyes that will scratch and kill you. You, you can see them, you know, you just stand still and you can see it for yourself. I just think of them as very mean, evil kitties because that's, they're going to scratch and kill you. So while you're trying to avoid being eaten by the kitties um, and trying to avoid the traps, you know, and mobs, you have these coins that are scattered throughout the whole dungeon. You can find them in chests or what you know these jars almost look like out of Zelda inspiration um, and each coin gives you know a certain amount like the gold will give you one all the way up to the red will give you you know four and with these coins you upgrade your character or buy a new one so let's just start off with the one that you know you defaultly get which is Sir Gilbert or Gar I, I can't even pronounce his name um, the knight so his ability is after upgrading him he gets a shield which can block melee damage and his next ability that you can upgrade to is like a thrust or attack. And it gets so far to where, you know, he has three shields that you can use to avoid damage. So that's just, just to give you some sort of like uh, aspect of what to expect with these characters. There, there's nine of them currently, and I think they're adding more. I don't want to go over each of them right now. But just to give you, you know, like a brief view, um, like the next character you get is Creeper Crow. And his abilities are, you know, he can avoid webs. Like, he's immune to them. Um, he also gets an AoE fear, so he can scare away most of the mobs. So again, once you have enough, you know, coins to buy a particular character you're wanting, you know, or upgrade him, that's all up to you. Um, I mean, overall, I, again, it's just a dungeon crawler. I mean, if you like these type of games, I mean, it's free. Why not give it a try? I mean, if you have time to kill, you're at the doctor's office waiting. Or you're on the subway and you have time to kill, why not? Um, again, it's for iOS and Android devices. Don't forget to hit that like button and wreck that subscribe button and I'll see you guys later.